Now to some good news for parents of children with attention deficit hyperactive disorder or ADHD. The FDA has approved the very first video game for treating kids with the condition and Will Reeve is joining us with more. Good morning, Will. Hey, good morning, Michael. Conventional wisdom holds that screen time for kids should be limited. But what if the images on the screen are prescribed by a doctor and are meant to engage and treat hyperactive children? Now get going. For the first time, the government has approved a video game as medical treatment. It sounds like uh, science fiction. We know that. In an historic move, the Food and Drug Administration announced the video game Endeavor RX as a digital therapy. All right, approved. Suit up. A landmark first for attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, ADHD, in children. Medicine delivered not as a molecule and a pill, but through an experience. And that's really what the video game is. The video game delivers an experience. This product is meant to improve attention. This is not meant to be a silver bullet or a be all end all. The prescription is for children ages 8 to 12 with certain ADHD symptoms. You're getting it. The game challenges users to dodge obstacles and collect targets as they navigate icy winter wonderlands and lava rivers guided by aliens who zip around on flying saucers. Technology that's the basis of the treatment is essentially challenging the child every second of their playing the game with things on the screen that stress their ability to pay attention to multiple things at once. The FDA claims the game can improve attention function and is backed by several studies, one of which found that 30% of the children no longer had attention deficit by one measure of objective attention. After playing the game for 25 minutes, five days a week for a month. The development grabbing the attention of the medical and gaming tech worlds as video games have long been considered detrimental to child development. I'm open-minded, but I'm rightfully a little skeptical about a video game treating ADHD. We've spent you know, years and years telling parents to decrease the, the screen time because we feel that it worsens ADHD. While these studies do not conclude that video games are a cure for ADHD, the game is a visual way to engage people suffering from the disorder, but not as a replacement for any established methods of treatment. Michael? Very interesting, Will. Thank you so much for bringing us that. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.